As a youth group, we every so often go help out at the rescue mission, and we do chapel and we help serve food. What up? <laughs> <laughs> Was that awkward? That was pretty awkward. But they are currently redoing the chapel, so we were just able to serve food. Now, the thing is, when you are serving food for the homeless, it makes sense that you don't eat any of the food because it's just it just doesn't work. Now, apparently, no one told this to Eric because, well... Eric just got kicked out of the kitchen. <laughs> Yeah. He was eating the food. That's bad. He was eating the food that was meant for the homeless people. I... What? I didn't, J -E I didn't say that. I mean, it's true, but I didn't say it. <laughs> that time of year again time where we forget about all of our christmas stuff and think about thanksgiving because for whatever reason the christmas season starts after halloween now i don't know i always thought it was after thanksgiving because of the whole black friday thing but um every friday is black friday when i look in the mirror but other than that you know november is really just kind of the the month where things just sort of go and aren't really super exciting. I mean, one time Eric and I walked into the basement and saw Ivana playing video games. <laughs> Somehow, Ivana got a hold of my PS4 and she was playing Sonic. No! Oh. Like, terribly. Like, did, did, did she even have a childhood? That's right, she was born when all the bad Sonic games were coming out. And then Eric tried to show her up, and uh, he was even worse, so I had a light bulb idea. Let's start a Let's Play of Sonic Mania. The game's still somewhat new. I mean, kind of. Came out a few months ago, but whatever. It's still relevant, right? Have you ever played a 2D Sonic game? No. <laughs> this is going to be awesome. I've never played a Sonic game. You've never played a Sonic no, game in your life? No, this is my first Sonic game. This is going to be hilarious. So yeah, that's... that's a thing. Eric's been taking over worship roles more um, in youth group, and also doing some in church and all that. And, uh, you know, like, it's cool seeing the... seeing youth rising up to the challenge of doing such things. And it seems that he's been actually influencing Will and Tori's kid. Or maybe it's the other way around. Not exactly sure. I don't know. You guys decide. Because a lot of people were going to be going out of town, the church decided to do a Thanksgiving service the uh, Saturday before Thanksgiving, as opposed to the day of that we've done a bunch of times, and uh, we did a breakfast, which was pretty cool. Just a lot of people bringing in different plates and stuff. I got really fat because of it, and um, I'm going to get even fatter when actual Thanksgiving happens, but it was a cool time. Um, the problem is we were supposed to have a, a worship set happening, and um, Eric was supposed to do that, and... Uh, Eric decided to not show up, so, yeah. Looks like, once again, Eric's ruining Thanksgiving. If you don't remember, last year, Eric blew up Sizer Hall. Oh, okay, here we go. Just everything on high. And it ended up destroying the Thanksgiving dinner that we had been preparing the entire day. So, um... We put him in the shame cube and hoped that he would learn his lesson, and apparently he didn't. So we had a Thanksgiving breakfast thing yesterday, and um, it, it was, was all really going good. it was all going great 
until worship started because Eric was supposed to do it and he just never showed up because he's too cool for it. Yeah. The lighting is like Star Trek. What? No, yeah, you're it's wrong. Like Star Trek. It's like Flair. You're absolutely wrong. So hey, wait, <gasps> I'm going to have. So the most awkward thing yesterday when we were doing worship is we're just like, um, I guess we kind of have to jump up and do this because it was supposed to be Eric's little solo act, but he didn't show you up, see, so that was just weird. That was my plan for it. I just wanted you to learn something and to learn how to improvise and keep the, 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 the passion and the glory of worship still without me. You're welcome. Because he didn't show up to the uh, to the thing, we um, we decided he had to be on Sunday greeting duty, mainly because the people who were supposed to be greeting weren't there. After people found out that I was greeting, they were like, Eric Smith, who played Tevia in Fiddler on the Roof. <laughs> They, he, he's there, and so, so they started coming, and there's this, like, huge group now, no, no, not over there, and, um, so, yeah, the, the, a lot of people, a lot of people, and, um, and, no, uh, a lot of people will come, I'm predicting the future. You know, hopefully this is a learning experience for him. Hopefully. I hope so. I really hope so. Hopefully, yeah. They'll come. They'll come. Been singing, sing. Little singer, been singing. Fun, fun, I say. Fun, I